<sighs> when it comes to Nike basketball, did you guys ever think it would make a comeback? I'm talking style-wise, not just playing ball and looking fresh on the court. But yo, these right here, these PG Blue Nessa, mmm, fire. Catch me cruising in Atlanta with a bad bitch Got a check, bring it to the bank and I'ma cash it Pulling like Mike was a Jordan or Jackson Shorty get brain on my What's up YouTube, welcome back to the page Welcome back to the channel Welcome back to another episode of Squin V V <laughs> now, in this episode, I want to bring you guys a special shoes. The shoes that I like personally, a lot of people bashing, they don't like it, they think it's overrated, or they just think it should have came before the real one. I don't know, I don't know. People are weird, people are weird. I'm different. Now, if you guys checked out my last video on basketball sneakers, I didn't review, but I talked about the KD12 and how that shoe itself made me start wearing Nike basketball again. And now, as soon as I dropped that video, What's this? Another basketball shoe. This shoe itself is pretty cool to me. I'm actually lost for words. As soon as I seen it, I was like, yo, what the hell? I've been trying to tell myself since I seen the official pictures of this shoe to stop liking it. Don't buy it. But I couldn't help it. And yeah, I spent my money and I got the blue NASA PG3s. So I don't know what the hell's going on. It's a whole bunch of, you know, circles, squares, and all uh, them thing that. When it comes to basketball shoes, I do go up a half size because they run a little snug. Now let's open this box right here and see the glory. That is the blue PG3 NASA's. I keep saying I love these shoes and I really, really mean it. Just because I'm a sucker for blue shoes and I don't know why. You know how people just love red shoes? Well, I just love blue shoes. Anything all blue, I cop. I don't know why I just do it. So here you have a close up of the shoe. As you see, one side has an orange panel. The other side has a red panel. They say PG has a love for space and his first drop, the orange Nessa, that sold pretty well and he just wanted to continue the tradition. So this is the fourth installment of the whole Nessa collab with Nike and this is actually the real first ever Nessa collab. You know, there's been shirts, shoes that has the Nessa print, none of them was official until this one right here. Get into the shoes. Checking out the bottom, you're gonna see the craters of the moon. So there's different holes over there that's gonna give you nice traction pattern. In the middle, you have the Paul George uh, signature. That's pretty dope that all these Nike uh, signature shoes come with an autograph. Now moving up to the midsole, you will see this nice metallic swoosh and then written around it. Don't tell me the sky's the limit when there's footprints on the moon. Now that's a big statement telling you like, yo, I could reach for whatever I want to reach. I could do whatever I want to do. And that's why I got this YouTube page. So hit that subscribe button if you're new and comment down below and give this a thumbs up. Now moving up to the upper, you're going to get an all blue mesh with, like I said, two different panels, one orange, one red. Moving on to the tongue, one shoe is going to have the American flag and the other shoe is actually going to have the PG logo that looks like a bow tie. I'm not going to hold you. These shoes to me, however, do scream a little kiddish, so I know a lot of men don't want to wear it. A lot of women don't like these shoes. They're buying it for their kids. So if you do have some kids, you can check these out. They're still available on the Sneakers app, Foot Locker, and, and a lot of foot sites. For me, like I said, they were a go-to. Fourth of July fit, this is pretty cool. A regular day, this is cool. A lot of Nike basketball shoes I use for sweatpants shoes. So when I wear sweatpants, I just throw these on. I don't want to wear Jordan all the time. So putting this, having this a little spin in your collection is pretty great. And for me, this was a good pickup. Now, did you pick up any of these? I'm talking about the blue NASA's, the white NASA's, the silver or the orange. Did you get any one? A lot of people said if this came out first, it would have sold out. But because it's the last installation, they don't like it. But hey. To each his own, everybody's different. Like for me, I said, I copped. I'm gonna throw these on feet to make you guys see how they looked. So maybe I could change your mind, persuade you guys to buy these shoes right here. And until the next episode, guys, love, manas, and always respect. Uh, 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 uh.